Vice President, 14 years after the LTT was defeated by the Sri Lankan state, the systematic singleization and Buddhization of the Tamil homeland in the north and the east has recommenced apace. The ancient Tamil worship site in Kurundur Malay has been destroyed and a Buddhist temple has been built in violation of court orders. Similar Buddhist temples are being built in the Tamil homeland where no Sinhalese live in Nayar, Tayati, Navatkuli, Mangulam Junction, Kachal Samalankulam, Akanyavani Rotu, to name a few. In some of the areas surrounding these illegal temple constructions, state-sponsored Singhala settlements have commenced. In the Batiklo districts in Amailatamadu and Madhavane, grazing lands where over 300,000 cattle graze, Tamils are being chased out by illegal Singhala state-sponsored corn cultivators in violation of court orders. The Madhuru Oya Right Bank Development Scheme is being used to demographically cleanse the area of Tamils and settle Singhalese. When Tamils non-violently protest against these racist actions of the state, they are charged under the Prevention of Terrorism Act, which the government has committed to the UNHRC to repeal. My colleague Mr. Selvraja Gajendran's arrest and harassment and violence unleashed on him is a case in point. Mr. President, despite us reporting to this council since 2012, the intransition of the Sri Lankan state continues. Shouldn't at least 15 years of hindsight convince member states to refer Sri Lanka to the ICC.